was a mistake. This was a mistake. This was a mistake. I am pretty sure that there are 20 toddlers in front of me. I've counted like three times and got three different numbers, but they were all around 20. And I feel like, okay, maybe the logistics are kind of important, but at this point, anything past one is a little bit too much for me. And today I want to see what it's like to take care of 20-ish toddlers. Oh, by my lonesome. So here's our handy dandy little setup going on right now. We do have like an outside pen for all the toddlers because by the way, there's not enough beds for these guys. Like not even close to enough beds. So there are a couple of beds here. I'm um, some toys scattered around a table for which I can put some food on because I, I have to figure out how to feed all of them. And three porta potties. I know it's not enough, but I can potty train more than one toddler at a time and there are about 20 and I imagine there are going to be a lot of wet diapers. So let's not worry about that. It is pee. If you look, it's pee. In here we have a couple more beds and, uh, you know, a couple toys. I don't know why I have these children. I don't know where I got them from. They're not even going inside. Oh no, some of them are. I'm essentially just like corralling all of them and come in my little minions. Maybe I'm growing an army. <laughs> Oh no, oh no. Some of the luckiest children will get to sleep indoors and uh, outdoors, it's fine, it's fine. It's like natural selection, but cavemen babies got to sleep outside, so why can't these? And then at the very edge of the property, I put like a very special bear, only the bravest and most daring baby can get the bear. Oh, we've got two of them already. Nope, that one gave up. That one's like, yeah, never mind. mind. This is the alpha baby. We've got two babies coming up to compete as well to try and get this. So I imagine a lot of babies are gonna end up fighting over this little thing. Thing and I'm so excited to see it. Fuck you up. I cannot dilly dally though because luckily the babies. Oh no, they are hungry. I was about to say, oh, none of them are hungry. Uh, I have to figure out how to feed 20 things uh, right away. Things? Babies. I'm just cooking the easiest thing I could possibly do. I don't want any of them to get taken away. I won't end the video if one gets taken away. I'm not gonna try and do that because this video would be very, very short. Oh, lovely. I hate cooking. This is gonna be very helpful. We have some toddlers struggling with the stairs. I'm sure they'll figure it out eventually. And if they don't, well, they don't need to go inside. Oh, that one's already angry. What? What? You just arrived. Are you crying? What's your problem? What's what's your name? Mila? What's wrong? You're angry because you were playing with nesting blocks? The fucking privilege on this baby. Can you please make that faster? You don't even need to like toss it, hon. You could just leave it. Oh, what are you doing? Okay, you know what? I'm not even gonna... You guys can do whatever you want at this point. Just don't die. Okay, so that's food plate number one. I'm gonna take this for the outside baby so they can just grab it when Whenever, and we're gonna have to make another one. This is gonna be a 24 hour kitchen that is staffed by one person, AKA me. And as a vegan, I only know how to make one thing and that's a fucking salad apparently. What? 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 Look, they're eating. Oh my God, they are self-sufficient. This is amazing. I bet the food's gonna run out like so fucking quickly. But if we just keep it going, the babies aren't gonna starve. And that's the only need that you actually have to take care of. These babies can literally piss themselves. They can pass out. They can smell awful. They could have like all sorts of diseases if they wanted to and they'll never get taken away as long as they are fed. Having a bad time? I don't care. This is just what the dice have rolled. All right, salad number two. It's actually a normal quality. Amazing. All right, more salad. Who's not finishing their plates? People are just leaving plates behind. Get eaten, buddy. What? You're literally starving. Should I control them? Am I allowed to control them? Why aren't you eating? It's right. You just picked up the plate. Don't tantrum. I hate babies. They're crying now. They're crying. What? What? What is your problem? I can't believe I bleached a kid's hair and then dyed it blue. Bleach can't be good for a toddler's scalp, right? That's what I'm fucking worried about. I have children starving and I'm like, oh, it's scalp. It's gonna get itchy. Did you just poop? Why are you speaking to the children? You get cooking now, woman. This is what I like to call feminism simulator. The domestic wife's duties are never ending. I'll have you know that looking after children is my life's passion. A lot of them are outside and just wandering around. I've lost quite a few babies to be honest. There's already one that's talking to the alpha bear right now. Which one is this one? This is Clyde. I saw some other ones wandering around and I don't know where they went. I don't know if they're heading back or not. Like we've got like these two stragglers going on over here. I'm not even sure this one was even my baby to begin with, but she's making her way here. And you know what? This is like a home for babies to come in and out as they please. We teach babies independence here. More food. This should be enough. Like I 
feel like if this didn't feed all of the babies, then I don't care. This isn't as chaotic as I thought it would be. This is actually a lot more wholesome. Like, babies are just taking care of themselves. They're having a really good time. Then again, this is only, like, not even 24 hours. I don't know what it's gonna be like in, like, five. What? What is so sad? You have so many friends you could hang out with. You know what? When you're depressed, you call up the girls and you go clubbing. So why don't you go get some of your girlfriends and go out, okay? The night is free and it's your own. There's a lot of congestion on the stairs. I feel like we need a little bit of traffic control going on here. Holy moly. Nobody said you can do that, okay? You can live here and stuff like that, but you have to clean up after yourself. And I know damn well you don't know how to operate a mop, honey. No, no, don't just leave it. Okay, all right. We're gonna have to get rid of a baby. I'm gonna pick this one up. Defiant babies don't get to stay. Hi, honey. Listen, I'm gonna pick you up, right? And we are going to move you right over here, right next to the street, okay? Yeah, no, the bad babies don't get to stay. All right, and there's this thing called hitchhiking where you just kind of stick a thumb out and hopefully a car will come and get you, okay, honey? Have a nice life. And just to be 100% sure, I'm just gonna lock the door for a specific sim and that's gonna be Mila, okay? <laughs> okay, have a nice life, honey. I literally left this baby be out on the street and this is what she's doing and I don't appreciate it. All right, we've got a little bit of a mess on our hands, but so far the babies are working together. Okay, they've uh, they've not eaten all of their food, so that's good. That means we've got plenty of rations left to spare. We've got some children already eating, some children uh, already sleeping. Honestly, this entire arrangement is not that bad. Listen, if you're a family-oriented sim, I absolutely recommend this. Looking at the moods of the babies, however, uh, it's not looking good. <laughs> I don't think you're supposed to do that. But hey, man, this entire arrangement works for me. I got me some movies, and I'm just relaxing with my shoes on the bed. That's pretty fucking gross. And sure, I can hear the crying and screaming of the children outside, but if you ask me, this is a little bit of a vibe. Wait, what do you mean Jaden is very hungry? Where the fuck is Jaden? Go, look, Jaden's going to get food right now. Don't come at me with this bullshit. Be like, oh my god, Jaden's gonna die. He's so hungry. Shut up. Look, they're happy. They're hugging and snuggling and everything. Listen, they're too young to know what trauma is. It's fine. Oh, no. Oh, no. They're starting to get hungry. Mila? Which one is Mila? Oh! This one's Mila. This is the one that I kicked out. Where did you get that? Someone gave her juice. Uh, and, I mean, that's impressive that you're making a living out on your own. I'm proud of you, but uh, wow. Just wow. Listen, I just need to remind you, though, that this is not yours. Like, it used to be yours when you lived back there. Where is it? Back there. But uh, now, it's not. You can't have this anymore. Watching them all, like, maneuver and run around reminds me of, like, an ant colony, and it's a little bit disturbing. See, look, this baby has the right idea. If you're gonna make a mess, do it outside, because this is no longer my property. Inside, unacceptable. Outside, totally fine. Oh, no, you upset. Oh, no, you don't have a roof over your head. That's so sad. You don't know where your next meal is coming from because you fucking destroyed my house. Yeah, that's so sad. So the food's about to go off, and I have no idea if babies will eat spoiled food. So, um, okay, ring-a-ding-ding. The kitchen is now open for business. Oh, uh, I hear I hear some of them um, falling asleep on the floor. It's fine. That's completely normal. I mean, who hasn't fallen asleep on the floor? Look at that one. That one went down. I mean, it's expected there aren't enough beds for everybody, but a lot of them are unoccupied, so I don't really understand why there's like a nap party on the ground right now. But they're babies, and babies are dumb as fuck. Listen, I know you didn't get a good night's sleep, and I know that you stink, but how about we just cook a little bit faster, okay? You don't need to cook the fish all the way, right? Like, you can undercook fish. That's totally safe. I mean, they're just fucking babies. All right, all the screaming and the crying and a bunch of them are making a mess now. And then that means I have to remember which ones these are so I can kick them out. Oh no. Oh no. You guys found your way into the cupboard and found a bunch of flour and chocolate. So next time you guys are fucking starving, don't come to me, okay? Because you obviously know where to get food. This is bliss and happiness. I'm a woman. I love the oven. Ah, uh, yes. Contemplating your future. Where's Exile Baby? Oh, there's Exile Baby. You doing okay? What are your needs at? Oh my god, Exile Baby's needs are actually quite good. Aside from needing to sleep, maybe kids are better off outside than they are inside. Well, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? The time has come. Let yourselves out into the real world. Be free, my children! Run, run! Awaken from your slumber and see the world around you. No longer you can find by the walls of society. Make your own living. Make your own society. I can't believe none of the children are getting taken away. Oh, no. Ah, yes. A job well done.